Welcome back to Wolves Fan TV for episode six of our predictions. Yes. <sighs> right then. Well, we didn't do so well last time. Um, no. I'm now on 33 correct and Stephen's on 28. So I'm uh, still keeping ahead of him, just about. Just about. Um, yeah. Just reviewing the uh, results from uh, the weekend. Yep. Um, Bradford slipped up. Um, thought they were going to beat Hartlepool, but only a draw. Carlisle Stevenage cancelled each other out, um, providing opportunities for others, perhaps. Uh, Swindon, they were hoping for a late charge, but um, four all away to Rochdale has uh, messed them up. Stop Stockport Mansfield, uh, they also shared the spoils, leaving gaps for others. Um, Crawley. They surprised everybody, didn't they? Uh, yeah, gain a result. Being Wimbledon, unbelievable. To Wimbledon are struggling at the minute. Yeah. Um, what we want to talk about a little bit is Tranmere. Um, lost at home to Newport. That was another one we got wrong. It it provided to be the end for Mickey Mellon. The Tranmere manager got fired. Ooh. And um, oh. we did have a comment on uh, our Warsaw Fan TV Facebook group. Yes. Which uh, you're all definitely involved all with. open to join. Um, Debbie Hughes, Tranmere fan, that uh, follows us as well. So that's good. Nice one, Deb. Um, proper gutted. I know we were losing games every week, but can't keep blaming the manager. It's the players on the pitch. Had Mickey Mellon had long enough? Um, we do get it with football fans and with clubs. The ch the chairman. Not giving the managers enough time. Um, we know Mickey Flynn has had his challenges. Yeah. But overall... He's prevailed. I mean, look. Starting to prevail. Well, I mean, one win, one swallow doesn't make a summer and all that. Yeah. But um, I think you got to keep faith with managers. I think they managers get sacked far too quickly, I think. Yeah. Well, um, the, the only instance where I can agree with... Um, Debbie. Debbie. And like what's happening here. Maybe the players aren't playing for the manager. Maybe the reason why they're you're getting bad results and losing games is because the players don't like the manager. Look at Villa, for example, with Steven Gerrard. Like Mings, for example. Yeah. They played awful under Steven Gerrard. The moment he left, absolutely amazing. He's been doing really well. So. You and I am right. Yeah. Uh, turned it round for them. Villa. They're flying, aren't they? Yeah. Um, and Warsaw, now we've got a win. Are we going to uh, push up the table? Hopefully. But <sighs> um, just looking at the table as it stands, with some of those players, some of those teams slipping up, the likes of Carlisle, Stockport, Stevenage um, and Mansfield, Northampton have stuck back into third place. We thought they were... Absolutely count. <laughs> well, well drifted <laughs> off the pace. Yeah. But um, they've remained consistent... Uh, won four of the last six, and um, they're back up there into third. So uh, can they maintain that? Carlisle do have a game in hand. Um, will remain to be seen. Right then, um, next week, or in fact tonight, we have Bradford Carlisle. That's another tough one. Yeah. Um, I think Carlisle are going to have too much for Bradford. Um, Crawley Doncaster. Crawley. Uh, the win at the weekend is going to boost them. But uh, Doncaster, have they given up the ghost on promotion? They're down to 12th now. Maybe. I've gone for a draw. Steam has gone for a draw. Or I've gone for a Doncaster win. With Crawley with their heads up and uh, Doncaster not reaching for the skies, I think it'll be a very even game. Yeah. Gillingham crew. Um, it was quite a surprise. Warsaw beat Gillingham and everybody was looking at, oh, it's Gillingham down on the table. But they were second in the uh, form table. So uh, they definitely picked up. And I am predicting they are going to beat Crew. But uh, you've got a draw, haven't you? I've got a draw. Another draw. Um, Mansfield at home to Grimsby. Grimsby, after their FA Cup exploits, back into league action. Hopefully, yeah. Mansfield are going to wear them out. Ready for Saturday when Walsall have got them. Um, but uh, I think Mansfield will win that. Uh, you're going for a win as well, haven't you? Yeah. And then we move on to Saturday. Barrow Wimbledon. Home win. I think Wimbledon can't get a can't get a result at the minute, can they? I know. Perfect time to play, isn't it? 
<laughs> we've got them next Tuesday, haven't we? Um, Colchester Tranmere, new manager bounce. Tranmere will probably win that. Crawley Rochdale, got that as a draw. Yeah, Crew, Crew Bradford, Bradford draw a well. draw. Um, Doncaster Northampton. Northampton, are they going to keep their winning run and hold on to third? We'll see. Then we've got Gillingham Carlisle. Carlisle are going to have way too much for them, I think. Grimsby Warsaw. We haven't done our match preview yet. Um, I've got a I've got a draw there, and you've got Warsaw win, you've got Warsaw win because I predicted the future and I bet Grimsby were gonna lose <laughs> to Brighton because Brighton are on mad form right now. That's and it. Warsaw to win against Grimsby. I mean, Gillingham. So um, see. So I might be right win. then. Hartlepool, Lake Norian, Lake Norian expect them to get that. Mansfield, sure, certainly going to beat Sutton. Not a thought. Well, Newport Harrogate yeah. draws Stevenage yeah. Salford I think another win for Stevenage get some nearer to their goal and uh, Swindon Stockport I've got a way win got a draw. but uh, you're down on Stockport a bit and I think you've been right they have sort of I don't like slipped Stockport. off it Sorry, guys. But... let's have a look at what we've got now for our updated table We've got Lane Orient to finish top, Carlisle second, Stevenage third, third. Um, 90 points, Stockport, Bradford, 81 points, Mansfield, Northampton, uh, Northampton, even though they've surprised us with a couple of results, they must have some really tough games coming up to drop away like that. We're saying uh, they're only going to get another 12 points in the next nine games. So that would be a bit of a collapse. We've still got Warsaw of ninth. Um, <laughs> so that's the optimistic view. Yeah. But um, right then, uh, look forward to your comments um, and see how many we get right again. Who's going to win this week, me or you? I don't know. Well, I've got, I've got, f I've got five, five games to catch up on. So. Well, you might pull a few back. Right then, Warsaw Fan TV, thanks for watching. The joy and the pain is ending, perhaps. Hopefully. Promotion, boys. It's coming. <laughs> and do you think Northampton are going to keep up and hold on to third? No. Carlisle. I think you're going to bottle it and go fourth. Carlisle fourth. and Stockport Personally. are pushing, aren't they? Stockport are going to finish seventh. I'm calling that. I'm saying Mansfield to finish top three. Mans Mansfield top three? They have got a ga if they win their game in hand, that puts them on fifty nine points. They're still quite adrift. Anything's possible. Of top three. Anything's and possible. we'll have to see. Anyway, thanks for watching. Cheers.